Hello Taurus, welcome to your next 48 to 72 hours reading. So Taurus, these messages are going to be general. They will not resonate with everyone. Take what does and leave the rest. This is also going to be timeless. So whenever you click on this video, that's when you're meant to see it. So let's jump into it Taurus, get you some overall energy. Spirit, give me some overall messages for Taurus. What is the message for Taurus, please? What is the energy for Taurus? Ooh, it's time to take action. New moon and Aries. All right. Somebody can have Aries highly aspected. Hold your vision. Fixed moon. All right, Taurus. So whatever it is that you want to do, just do it. Hold your vision. Like stand firm on your passion on your belief like do not let anybody sway you don't waver just stick to it here ain't nothing to it but to do it Taurus so go ahead step out of your comfort zone and just get to work I feel like once you start this once you once you begin this I'm hearing like a new approach for some of you, you may be thinking about taking a new approach to, to a situation but once you just go ahead and just do it you know kind of like um cold turkey how somebody quits smoking cold turkey like that's how you have to do you just have to get on it don't even think about it because if you think about it you may overthink and end up not taking any action so god wants you to really not operate out of fear but operate out of faith so let's go ahead and tap into some more energy spirit give me some more messages for Taurus, what's going on with Taurus? What's the messages? For Taurus, ooh, what do I have? Ooh, the two of wands, yeah. I feel like for some of you, you're really focusing on your future at this time. Some of you could have a platform here. Ooh, the queen of swords, somebody lying. Somebody lying, Taurus, is this you? You lying? Somebody could have air highly aspected. Give me another energy for Taurus. Okay. Oh, the Six of Pentacles and the Hermit. Okay. So we have the six, the Queen of Swords and the Six of Pentacles as the center of the reading here. Somebody could be um giving to someone, investing in a situation secretly. Somebody could be taking care of someone in secret. This Queen of Swords in the reverse. Let's go ahead and pull some more energy. Yeah, somebody's taking care of someone, paying someone in secret, giving somebody money here. Give me some energy um, on the Two of Wands. Why is the Two of Wands here for Taurus? What's going on? Wow, the hangman. So I feel like you're very focused on your future. You're very focused on, I'm hearing like progress. Um, somebody wants change here pisces energy some of you could be getting a new idea page of pentacles in the next 48 to 72 hours it could have taken a long time to come to you but you're finally going to have that aha moment towards give me another energy on the two of wands why is the two of wands here okay Ooh, the Ten of Pentacles. So I feel like you're focused on your success. You're focusing on leveling up, your stability. Somebody may also um, have to take care of their family as well. So it's like you're the breadwinner. You're the matriarch or patriarch of your family. Um, why is the Queen of Swords here? Why is the Queen of Swords here in the reverse? What's going on? The eight of swords yeah somebody um may end up getting locked up here somebody may end up going to jail somebody been lying about something somebody could have lied under oath give me another energy on the queen of swords why is the queen of swords in the reverse for taurus oh the knight of pentacles or somebody could have lied about taking an oath Somebody's been lying for a very long time here to keep someone stuck, to keep someone bound here, not being able to make progress. Yeah, somebody's been lying for a long time to keep someone trapped. Give me the energy on um, the Six of Pentacles, keep someone trapped in their head. 
not being able to to take any action it's time to take action yeah not being able to move forward or move on from something or a situation give me an energy on the six of pentacles why is the six of pentacles here for taurus the seven of wands so somebody's getting ready i'm hearing no more so somebody wants to stop giving to something somebody wants to stop investing in somebody give me an energy on the six of pentacles oh the high priestess yeah somebody feels manipulated pisces energy heavy on the pisces in this reading somebody feels like they're being manipulated somebody feels like somebody has a lot of secrets they're not being honest here like somebody's trying to play a lot of games to get someone to still keep investing to still get to keep someone still giving to something give me another energy on the hermit why is the hermit here yeah, Hermit to the High Priestess. Somebody has a lot of secrets here. Why is the Hermit here for Taurus? What's the energy? Strength. Leo energy. Somebody is determined to keep a secret. Like, they're determined. I'm hearing oath. Like, somebody could have swore someone to, like, a, a secret oath here. Like, Leo on strength. Give me another energy on... The Hermit. The Ace of Wands. Okay, so... Somebody is sick here. So somebody kind of swore someone to keep this information a secret. Yeah, somebody has like some type of illness here and they don't want anyone to know about this. Something could be actually going on with someone's wand. Give me an energy on the Ace of Wands. Why is the Ace of Wands here for Taurus? The Three of Pentacles. Yeah, somebody's getting checked out. Like somebody had to go to a doctor and get checked out, literally. That's what I'm getting with this Three of Pentacles. Yeah. Give me an energy on strength. Why is strength here? So... Somebody's paying someone to keep their secret about an illness. Give me an energy on strength. Why is strength here for Taurus? Ooh, the Empress. Okay. Libra. Taurus, your energy. Why is the Empress here? The Wheel of Fortune and the Hierophant. Taurus, you're heavy here. Sagittarius, Leo, Taurus again. Aquarius, Scorpio. Wow. So something has to do with like someone's divinity here. And something going into someone's favor. Give me an energy on this Wheel of Fortune. Why is the Wheel of Fortune here? For Taurus. Woo-wee. The Three of Swords. So, this is a third party situation. Time reveals all things. So, somebody definitely could have been married here. And have children with this person. Give me an energy on the Hierophant. Why is the Hierophant here? The Eight of Cubs. But somebody's walking away. Somebody's walking away heartbroken from a situation. And I'm looking at the moon and it's like you fool. Like somebody did something foolish. Somebody took a foolish action. Somebody's very hard-headed. And now they want to go into hiding. Give me an energy on the hangman. Why is the hangman here? The world. Something has come to an end here. A cycle is closed. Leo, Taurus, Scorpio, Aquarius energy. Give me an energy on the Ten of Pentacles. Why is the Ten of Pentacles here? The Emperor. Wow. Oh, we have the Emperor and the Empress. Something has to do with someone's divinity.
somebody could take care of a, a lot of people. A lot of people depend on this emperor. Give me an energy on the Eight of Swords. Why is the Eight of Swords here? Why is the Eight of Swords here? Wow, the devil. Ooh, we. Somebody is um delusional. Like somebody's possessed. That's what I'm getting. Somebody's literally possessed. Give me an energy on this Queen of Swords is possessed. Give me an energy on the Knight of Pentacles. Why is the Knight of Pentacles here? The Three of Wands. Somebody had to wait here. Somebody had to wait for a very long time for something. Give me an energy on the devil. Why is the devil here? Somebody's lie had someone waiting for a long time. Whatever lie this person told, it kept someone waiting. Give me an energy on the devil. Oh, wow. Somebody married this person? Give me an energy on the Three of Wands. Why is the Three of Wands here? The Star. Aquarius energy. Give me another energy on the Three of Wands. Why is the Three of Wands here? the ace of pentacles so somebody could um be waiting on some pregnancy results somebody could also be three months pregnant somebody could have lied about being pregnant somebody lied about being pregnant waiting on pregnancy results somebody could have said like they were like in the first trimester somebody lied about being pregnant to keep somebody stuck. So this person could move forward. And somebody could have married this person. Based off of a lie. Yes, this person did. Give me an energy on the Queen of Pentacles. Why is the Queen of Pentacles here? Wow. Why is the Queen of Pentacles here? Yep. They got into a full-blown relationship on a lie. The gag was the child that's non-existent. Give me an energy on the seven of wands. Why is the seven of wands here? Hold your vision. Somebody was like, I want this. And I'm going to do whatever I got to do to get it. Give me an energy on the seven of wands. Why is the seven of wands here? Wow, justice. So somebody's going through karma. Libra energy and they can't stop this. It's like whatever you put out is what you get back. Six of Pentacles. Give me an energy on the High Priestess. Why is the High Priestess here? The Page of Pentacles. Yeah, the secret is this child. That's the secret. Somebody kept... Oh my goodness. This person who lied and said they was pregnant did this so they can continue to get money out of this masculine. Like, this person had this masculine paying for so much stuff, just giving them money, giving them money. Because this emperor thought that he had a child on the way. So it's like, I'm going to take care of, you know, the mother of my child. <sighs> Give me another energy on the Page of Pentacles. Why is the Page of Pentacles here? Like, somebody ran, like, a whole scheme here to get money. Like, oh, I'm pregnant. Oh, I need this. I need that. I need this. I need that. And he would just give it, give it, give it. The chariot, Cancerian energy. Give me another energy on the page of pentacles. Why is the page of pentacles here? The nine of pentacles. So whatever this masculine um was giving... This energy, it put her in the Nine of Pentacles. Like, somebody literally came up. I mean, somebody came up off of the amount of money they received from this emperor. 
Somebody could also brought a new car. Like somebody came all the way up. Like this person got a lot of money. Give me an energy on the chariot. Like this was a whole scheme. Why is the chariot here for Taurus? Why is the chariot here for Taurus? The sun. Yeah. So, this person was like, the baby passed away. Like, pretty much this person said, oh, the baby, the child didn't make it. The child died. I, I miscarried. That's what this person did. Lied again. First, they lied about being pregnant. Then, they lied about losing the child. Yep, the chariot to the sun. Give me an energy on the Three of Swords. Why is the Three of Swords here? Why is the Three of Swords here for Taurus? The Three. Ooh, the Six of Cups. Wow. So this person played on either your or this other person's childhood trauma. Somebody had a very traumatic childhood. Um, Somebody like... Went through like a lot of devastation, a lot of heartache, a lot of tears, just somebody mourned a lot, somebody lost a lot, somebody um grew up too early. They pretty much like missed out on the joys of being a kid. Somebody did not have a good childhood experience. And, and this person played on that. Give me an energy on the Eight of Cups. Why is the Eight of Cups here? Why is the Eight of Cups here? For Taurus, the Eight of Wands, the number oh, 88 we have here. Give me another energy on the Eight of Cups, the Four of Pentacles. So this masculine is walking away. Um, they're definitely receiving a lot of communication. There could be a lot of back and forth going on. But somebody's pulling back their energy, their meat, their resources, their money. Somebody feels very triggered here. For some of you, this is somebody that wanted a child, that wanted to be a parent. Somebody could also be a single father. Give me a, an energy on this Eight of Wands. Why is the Eight of Wands here? The King of Cups, yeah. Somebody has like a big heart. They like to give. They like to do a lot for people. It makes them feel wanted. It makes them feel needed. It makes them feel loved. This is what this person lacks, love. And so they seek for that in other people. Why is the Four of Pentacles here? This was very triggering for this person. Why is the Four of Pentacles here? Judgment. So somebody's going to be up on the judgment here. Somebody um, is going to experience a lot of loss, a lot of changes when it comes to their finances. Yeah, and this is happening fast. Yeah, somebody's stability is changing very quickly. Judgment is being called on this situation. A lot of secrets here. The moon. But somebody's being guided away from this situation. Yeah, somebody's being led away from this. Somebody was in the blind. Somebody was in the dark. Somebody got tricked out of money. <sighs> Give me an energy on the star. Why is the star here? Wow. Wow. Ooh, the king and queen of wands. 
So something was a faded relationship. Two people were definitely destined to come together. But we had some interference here. We had a Queen of Pentacles come into the mix. And ran a whole play, ran a scheme on this person. Said they were pregnant. In order to get this emperor energy. And then it turned out to be a lie. And they did this for money so they can come up. So they can be in this nine of pentacles energy here. Give me an energy on judgment. Why is judgment here? Yeah, somebody intervened in a divine connection because they wanted to be taken care of. They wanted money, resources. Give me an energy on judgment. Why is judgment here? The truth. The truth is coming out. Yeah, the truth is going to be seen. Somebody's going to have full clarity about what's been going on. Like, hold your vision. Like, this is somebody that wouldn't give up until she got what she wanted. Give me an energy on judgment. Ooh, the ten of wands to death. So, somebody, life is about to be hard, hard, hard. Like, somebody's about to go through a significant change. Somebody's about to struggle, have a lot of burdens on their back here. A lot of things are going to transform in this person's life. Scorpio energy. Give me something on this King of Cups. Why is the King of Cups here? Okay. The Seven of Pentacles. And yeah, this person didn't get anything out of it. They lost. This person took a huge loss. By investing in this energy, this Queen of Pentacles energy, by committing to this person. Yeah, somebody took a huge gamble and lost a lot in the process. Give me something on the world. And then we'll close it out. Give me a message on the world, please, for Taurus. Yeah, like somebody came in like, oh, I'm pregnant. And that was it. That was all it took. Ooh, the nine of swords. Somebody's stressing out. Yeah, somebody's worried. Somebody don't know what to do. Give me one on this two of cups. Why is the two of cups here? Why is the two of cups here? The tower in the reverse. Somebody know that this has changed everything. Give me another energy on the two of cups. The moon. Give me one on the moon. Pisces, Cancerian energy. Why is the moon here? Ten of swords. Yep. Because somebody was being betrayed. Yep. Somebody was betrayed. And for a lot of you, this betrayed happened. This betrayal, I should say, happened because this masculine betrayed their counterpart. So God allowed for this person to be betrayed. And there's nothing you can do about it. That's what I'm hearing. So God didn't even intervene in the situation. God just allowed whatever was going to happen to happen. Because somebody betrayed their partner here. And so they were betrayed. Give me energy on the tower in the reverse. Scorpio energy on the tower. What do I have? The page of swords. Whatever, um... This person is going through it can be seen publicly like there's no hiding this 
I'm hearing reputation. Somebody's reputation has been ruined as well. Give me another energy on the tower. It's like God allowed this person to fall. Why is the tower here? The fool. Yeah, because somebody, somebody listened to other people and they left without thinking it through and because of their actions they brought a lot of chaos to their life a lot of negative changes is happening because of the action this person took Aquarius energy yeah by listening to people And it's like, when this person betrayed you, the way this fool is to the Ten of Swords, they didn't even care. This person didn't care. That's the thing. Yeah. They did this behind your back. Something they did behind your back here. And they didn't even have a care in the world about it. Somebody was very cocky. But they ended up falling into the same trap. They ended up being betrayed here. Give me something on the King of Wands. Why is the King of Wands here? Yes, this person did something behind your back here, collective, that you don't know about. Six of Swords. Give me another energy on this King of Wands. Why is the King of Wands here? The Nine of Wands. So now this person is walking away. And they're putting up their guard. They're setting boundaries. Yeah, they're walking away. Somebody feels like a fool. Somebody feels foolish. Somebody was so confident. They knew they was doing the right thing by doing this to you. Somebody listened to the wrong pe people, the wrong person. Somebody was blindly led to a swords. Give me something on this page of swords. Why is the page of swords here for Taurus? Look at this, the king of pentacles. So there's a lot of communication going on about this person and their stability. Again, somebody has lost a lot of money. Somebody's taking a major hit financially. This is a part of their karma. All of this is a part of this person's karma. Whatever they're going through. For some of you, this person's sick. They have some type of illness. Something's going on with their male part. They was betrayed by this queen of pentacles. A, a false pregnancy. Their money is going down. Because they betrayed you. Somebody betrayed you. And it's like they didn't even care. Like for some of you, this person didn't even apologize. They just kept it moving. And now they're in a space where they have to defend themselves. And they did this in secret, behind your back. For some of you, this person had a lot to say about you, talked about you behind your back. For some of you, this person told your secrets. Your person, your counterpart. Who you have a contract with. Betrayed you. And so God allowed for this person. To be betrayed. That's the way the cookie crumbles. So let's pull a final message. What is the final message for Taurus? What is the final message for Taurus? And now people are talking about this person. Now people are talking about this person and what they're going through and their struggles and their challenges. I have your greatest challenges are your biggest blessings. Don't give up before the magic happens. You are leveling up. Aries got this same message. For some of you, you may want to go look at the Aries reading. I feel like this is um, a continuation of that reading. So you may want to go look at that. Um, you could also be a cusp here. But yes, somebody wanted to level up. So they did whatever they could do to get the results they wanted. Somebody didn't have any boundaries here. 
somebody wanted to win at all costs and she did and now this masculine is looking crazy because it's like the one that they should have held on to the, the real one the one that would have held him down he betrayed this person and then the one who he should have kind of just threw to the wayside he upheld her and she ended up betraying him lying to him creating a lot of changes in his life a lot of burdens now he's guarded he's the wounded warrior He feels some type of way now. But rejection is for your protection. So regardless of what you've been through, Taurus, there's a blessing that's going to come out of this whole situation. And then at the bottom, I have all this temporary. It's okay not to feel your best like the moon. We go through phases. Give yourself time to get your groove back. This too will soon pass. Yeah. You are going to be able to move past this. Most definitely. For some of you, you already have. But yeah, this is just a temporary situation. Nothing is forever. You know, life is all about change. And for you, you're going to experience a change for the better. While your counterpart here experiences a change for the worst. So Taurus, this is your reading. I hope it resonates. Stay true to thyself and real with thyself. Grow with me as I grow with you. Stay blessed.